The universe is a vast, remarkable place. But it is also dangerous, with peril at every corner, in every land, at every world. I think we should take a look. I'm the Doctor, and travelling with me is gonna be radical. Hello! Well, Fall of the Doctor is out there, fully done and released, and I'm the Doctor now. <laughs> Fancy that. For those who are unaware, I have recently taken over the role of the Doctor in Luke Newman's DW 2012 Doctor Who fan series. So that is going to be one of the most uh, <laughs> defining moments of my life at this point, because it's the closest I'll ever get to actually being the Doctor, and it honestly feels like actually being the Doctor, so that's pretty cool. So, yeah, if you want to check it out, feel free to check it out. Uh, I'm start. I start at the end of the Fall of the Doctor movie, and yeah, that scene is kind of. It's definitely um, a bit of a romp, isn't it? So, firstly, I have got to say a massive thank you to everyone who has uh, sent me kind messages and well dones and all that sort of jazz uh, to me regarding my post regeneration scene in Fall of the Doctor, and I'm exceptionally grateful because I was this time. Uh, I'd say <laughs> how's the best way of saying this because. This video is going to last for a long time. I'm not going to say yesterday, I'm going to say the day of release. There we go, that'll do. Uh, the, on the day of release, I was exceptionally nervous and <laughs> I was breaking it for the day. I was watching the clock time down and it was just, I was a bit of a wreck. But I'm just glad that everyone has received it well. Um, well I say everyone, I don't want to generalise too much. It turned me from, uh, from a ball of nerves into something a bit more happy. So... Thank you once again for all of that. Also got to say a massive well done to Luke Newman on such a fantastic... Oh, I hate full naming him, he's a good mate of mine. Um, but just to say Luke. Um, but just well done on such a fantastic magnum opus final episode. And you should be extremely proud. Everyone should be proud of their involvement in that episode. And it is honestly the culmination of four or five years of hard work and... Everyone should just be proud of it. And if you haven't seen it yet, definitely go and see it because this video is probably contained spoilers already, but honestly, give it a watch. I mean, admittedly, I have wondered about this day for so many years, like since Luke asked me to take over, how would I feel on the day? And uh, to be honest, I'm struggling to get words out because it's such a complex feeling. And I'm just happy, nervous still, because I've got to live up to that. And yeah, it's just... He's left behind a legacy, and hopefully I can do it justice over the coming years, and we'll see what happens. Um, I hope you guys are ready for what's going to come. I think it's going to be radical, you never know. But, yeah, what is to come from here? Well, Series 5 is well underway. Uh, the first episode is nearly fully shot. We will choose a time for it when it will come out. Uh, we've still got to work that out. We'll work out all the kinks, and then we will throw it out there. Because the first episode is going to be called How Time Flies and it's written by both myself and Luke as well. So it's going to be a bit of a creative best of both worlds to get on the ground running. And uh, yeah, Luke will be continuing on as head writer, creative director, etc. And I will be pretty much the face at this point, it seems. Yeah, it's it's going to be a cool journey and I really cannot wait to get started. It's just... Ah, oh, it feels nice to be able to decleanse all the tension out of me because I've been getting increasingly nervous over the past few weeks, as I've probably said earlier. But now it's out there, it feels like I can relax. Well, I'm not going to put a time limit on me. We'll see how we go. Maybe I'll stay for a year. Maybe I'll stay for a hundred years. Then again, I might be dead in a hundred years, so the chances of me carrying on that long are pretty slim. But you get the idea. That's the main thing. There will be changes in place for Series 5, such as the brand new Sonic Screwdriver, lovingly designed by my dear friend James Sutton, aka Scarecrow Sutton on Instagram. And he has done an absolutely sterling job of it, and I can't love it enough. It's just so shiny. I love it. So just, it fits my Doctor's aesthetic, to say the least. But yeah, that's another thing. My Doctor, like Luke is the Little Red Doctor, my moniker is the Purple Doctor. Keeping it simple, keeping it colour-coded. But I feel that kind of suits him a lot because 
He just likes the colour purple. And he dresses in primarily the colour purple. Nothing to do with the movie. That was a sad movie. Whoopi Goldberg was good in it, though. Anyway, I digress. We've got a good series of about eight episodes lined up, and I won't do any confirmations about what the remaining seven episodes will contain. But apart from how time flies, it's going to be pretty unique. We've got the scripts going and writing and being written. And honestly, we hope you enjoy them because I think that they're going to be quite good. So we'll see. I take nothing for granted, but I just really hope you guys enjoy what we have lined up for you. As for my doctor's personality, well, the more I act as him, the more I, the less I can say he's like a past incarnation. I've tried to go on really as unique as I can with this. And so if I'm like a past incarnation, that'll be up to you, the viewer, to determine who I'm like. So, yeah, I think that'll be quite interesting to see what you guys think of me when, uh, when Series 5 starts up proper, which will be later this year. Other than that, there'll be various more bits and pieces and info about Series 5 being released throughout the year, throughout the rest of this year, and into next year, and we'll, we'll see how it goes, because I'm really, really looking forward to this journey and taking you all on this journey with me. So I hope you all enjoy it, and it's going to be radical. We'll see what happens. So, without a doubt, that's me, the Purple Doctor, signing off. See ya!